Assalamu alaikum everyone welcome to today's Bitcoin update for Friday 8th of April and uh, hope you guys have a blessed Friday and uh, one more thing if you want to take my trading analysis course for the pirate trader you can do so to pay with 29 bucks join me into the discord and message me over there now uh, Bitcoin is quite positive right now guys um, yesterday I was thinking that maybe potentially you're gonna see Bitcoin start to roll over to the downside over 41k 40 40k but the charts keep changing and I do have different opinions on Bitcoin right now. So uh, bringing in the 55, uh, what, what I just see is a back test of an EMA. What uh, all this means is that you make a bull cross right over here. You went up confirming the bull cross and you came down to test the EMAs. You're bouncing off the EMA to actually continue to this particular journey right over here. Do you understand my point here? So this is nothing more than just a retest of the EMAs because a lot of altcoins, even let's say Dogecoin as well. Okay, I'm going to show you Dogecoin. What did Dogecoin do? Same, same thing. Make a bull cross right over here, surge to the upside, came down here, hold the, the retest of the EMAs and it's holding the support trend line right over here. And this is like a fantastic entry opportunity. Someone wants to trade Dogecoin right now. It looks really good. So... A lot of uh, altcoins have come back to support, let's say courtesy as well. So if you look at CDSI, uh, this one, what did it do on the daily? Well, uh, not the back test of the EMA the way it was supposed to do, but there was a back test of the support and resistance. For example, this was a rounded bottom right over here, broke out of it, came down, hold the retest right there. Do you see that? So it doesn't make sense for the altcoins at the moment to start to move to the downside once again, okay? Uh, things are looking good. SLPs are also probably looking good. Now that was uh, the EMA story on the daily. On the four hour time frame yesterday, uh, when I saw this, uh, you know, little bit of a pull to the upside, it was looking like a bear flag, but then again, uh, more candles printed in showing that you're putting in a some sort of a, you know, ascending triangle, which is a bullish pattern right now. So I do expect this ascending triangle uh, result to come either to pop to the downside back to 42,000 again, and maybe who knows, we can then continue to go to the downside. But uh, the favor is that after this push to the downside you're gonna have a little bit of maybe a relief to go to the upside and what's the next technical target from here to here that's actually gonna be taking you all the way back to 44,681 okay now if you do go to 44,681 today then what are you doing what are you doing if you go back to 44,648 you potentially might be putting in a morning star Okay, so this red candle, huge red candle, you almost have a spinning top doji, and then you go to 44,600, 800, then you're some sort of putting in a morning star right over here, and all you did is you came down and make a fake out and very quickly went back to retest this neckline, uh, or are you just going to retest the neckline to be rejected over here and then go down, because by the end of the day, you've broken out of this, you know, descending triangle, so it was a descending triangle that you broken out of. Maybe go back to the retest of the descending triangle, get rejected, and then start to roll down. Something like this can happen. Or you might just go back up and hold the retest, pass the retest, and then boom, continue to the upside, you know. Go back to tackle the EMA. So uh, come here, hold the 10, the 20. Of course, the 10 is going to be a little bit of a heavy resistance if you start to do so. But you can have even EMA's compression. EMA's come down, go up like this. 55 comes up and then boom you pop to the upside the 10 comes and then boom from there you start to move to $53,000 okay and that's it for uh, today a big one update I'm just watching for that ascending triangle to play out and uh, if you want to learn more uh, you can check my trading course as well and I'm going to see you in the next one Allah Hafiz